All right, Sarah, how's it going? It's going good. It's Very going good. Really good. Uh, I love coming to this event. It's such a great cause. Uh, how did you get involved in this? So I met Emily. Um, I started doing a couple things with the sidewalk project, and um, and her and I just kind of bonded. And then she told me about that she has art galleries and are put together these you know these incredible events. And she asked me if I would be a part of that, and I was super honored because there's so many incredible talented artists and you know work up here so yeah. um, I'm definitely honored and humbled to be, to be very here. Very cool and you just picked up photography recently like look at your work I feel like you've been doing it your whole life it's so good you know. Thank you for saying that yeah it's been pretty recent since uh, about 2017 mm -hmm. my husband got me a camera and so for Valentine's Day and yeah. I not because I had said oh I you know I really want to go into photography but uh, he whatever saw something that I didn't and so then wow. I started taking photos while out on tour with with the band and mm -hmm. uh, I, I fell in love with it and then it just became kind of an emotionally like a almost like my own outlet for me that I needed to have like uh -huh. a artistic outlet on the road um, do you do anything else besides just photography to bands or any nature shots or anything like that I do um, when traveling I did try to take quite a few photos of different mm -hmm. um, areas and towns and um, and just try to capture like very organic kind of situations what you know and um, but yeah, so I, I do a variety, but I, I'm so intrigued by photographing bands and of all different types of bands, all different types of music. Um, I just feel like there's uh, an emotion that's happening and there's yeah. a lot happening on stage and I want to be able to capture that and, and share that in a way with, you know, if somebody's looking at the photo and um, I feel like if you can, if you can get um, that raw emotion in a photograph, I, that's, that's what I aim for. And whether it's um, fun, sad, frustrated, whatever it might be, because music is such an emotional thing, yeah. you know. And um, I just I hope that that transfers the way that I see it, because I'm I'm feeling it while watching and photographing, and that's I'm why feeling that everyone energy. does that. That's why we love rock for photography and stuff. We can see the emotion in there. You know, we can feel the music almost in the photo. You know, right, right. I, do you so have I like so. advantage since you're in a band a singer yourself? Like you kind of know what? The, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I, I do think um, there is some kind of advantage in that. I do pay attention to where I, you know, if the music's gonna get kind of heavier, or stronger, and yeah. I, I feel like there's just something kind of coming at you and coming for you that. Um, I want to I want to catch that or you know it's like momentum of it all but also um, knowing what that feels like to be up there you know not to any degree of the the bands that I photographed but but that adrenaline and and those emotions are happening and and they're you know and and being on stage it's not a flawless thing it's you know there's mm -hmm. there's a lot of stuff that's going on and happening and, and just you know knowing and paying attention to those moments and um, it's just it's beautiful the way that it kind of organically happens. Speaking of beautiful, I was at the, the your husband's birthday show, basically oh, yeah. what it turned into, your band, uh, Green Day Did Surprise, and Trey Cool's side band, uh, Dead Mermaids, who I absolutely love, you know. Yeah. That was fun. He brought a birthday cake up on stage, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, that was a surprise for Trey. He wasn't expecting yeah, okay. to have a cake, and um, I mean, Bjorn, 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 Bjorn's in. Um, it's a, it's well, was a, the whole Green Day thing a surprise? Or was that was a, a total surprise. So, okay, so it wasn't planned when they showed up or anything? It was no, I mean, they were all there yeah. and they they love to play. I mean, they, they're they fucking rock and roll, you know? So it's like they're going to be all together on stage. Yeah. They're going to play what they love to play. And that's, I loved it because they were so loose and obviously they were they having some fun up there. Right, <laughs> you know? oh yeah. That's what made it so good though, so. Right. Great, well amazing. Where can people stay in touch with you of all your amazing work, uh, band, your photography, is there online, website? So uh, mostly all on Instagram. I don't have a Twitter or any of that kind of stuff, but um, there's Rose Wright photos on Instagram and then uh, One Less Zero is my band. Yeah, very so, cool. So yeah. All right, well thank you so much for your time to talk to us. Such a pleasure. Oh.